Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Today is Monday, June 3rd, 2019, and we have been busy today. <laughs> so, uh, the old racks have all been taken down. I gotta smash off all the concrete off the ends of these ones here. Um, and then I gotta pull all this rebar out of here, and I'll have to pick up all this wood and all that type of stuff. But, uh, I, uh, was doing that, getting that going, so it's been, uh, I'll have to fill in the holes here as best I can. I can actually take some of the dirt off there and probably put it in there, but, uh, but we have also the other solar panels up now. Okay, so we got three different kinds of solar panels, okay? <laughs> so, uh, these ones here, these six, are the 250 watt panels. These ones here in the middle and the top one over here are 255 watt panels. And then the last five are 300 watt panels. So that's why they all are different. But uh, so what we were doing today, I uh, actually got up on the ladder and uh, I was cleaning. I, could, I couldn't do the top row, but I cleaned uh, these four, these two. And then before we put all these six up, we cleaned all of those. Well, with um, with like Windex, got them all clean so they're they're better and they're ready. And uh, so I'm going to show you what else in the back side here. What we did. So these these six panels are all tied together in here. Okay. The other nine panels are tied together into the other string. All right. And those all go underground. And they go to here, which will eventually be a building. Okay, I'm hoping to have that built this year. We will see how things go. Uh, the other thing that we did today is uh, we tied this uh, Unistrut, or I'm gonna make sure I say this freaking right. What do we got here? Oh, Super Trust is what it says on there. Yeah, Super Trust. Okay, so we're we tied the Super Trust. In with all of uh, you know, with, well, with three of them because that's all we had enough to, of these to do was the three for now. But we will tie in the other ones down the road. But uh, and then what I'm thinking of doing is either down the road a little bit, uh, depending. We're going to put in either another pole or something back here to tie into here. Uh, if I put another pole in, we'll probably use the Super Trust again to tie that in just to give it extra added strength. Because um, like I said, we went with the 2-inch poles. We probably should have gone with uh, the 3-inch or the, uh, you know, even the 6-inch. But, you know, we that's what we went with because of affordability at the time. So we can always upgrade things later to make it stronger. But I figure if we put in more poles back here and tied them in here together, there's the puppies. You better leave those kitties alone. Yes. Lunatics. Um, so anyway, but that's what we're going to end up doing is something to that effect to tie these in together. Okay. But uh, so, yeah, this is uh, this is what we got done today. We got the other six panels up. We tied these in together, and I'm going to show you. This is uh, much sturdier. You can see there's still a little flex to it, but it's a lot stronger than it was. And uh, but it's just you know, we had some pretty good winds going today, and uh, these everything was fine. So um, hopefully we're not going to have any issues. But uh, so that was the main project of today, and also taking down the old frames of the uh, solar rack and the other, uh, you know, for the other panels. Uh, it's very chilly up here today. It is actually only, I think it's about 56 degrees right now. So it was a very, very chilly day today. I'm actually thinking we might end up uh, doing a fire tonight, to be honest with you. Here we are, June 3rd. I yeah, I probably will. Yeah, she had a, a thing with school today where they were outside like all day long, and uh, but yeah. So anyway, see, I think I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take extra dirt off of here and fill in these holes with that because we do have the extra dirt there. 
Um, I'm going to have to break those up. I don't even know what I'm going to do with all that. Okay. Yep, he does it. Yep. Because he's the best. Luce is the man. And then there's Mr. Max over here. He's a good cat. He's a good boy. But, uh, so anyway, so I'm going to take you inside real quick here to the building and uh, show you that. Actually, what I think I'm going to do first, obviously, honestly, guys, I'm going to break up as much of this as I can and fill that, a lot of that into the holes, and then I will take the dirt and I will finish off um, filling the holes. That's what I'm going to probably do with that. Eventually, what the game plan is, this whole area basically from the camper corner here all the way down to where the grape vines are, I want to turn this whole area into a greenhouse. What? Well, that's okay. Well, that's uh, you know what? I'm going to take these ones here the way that this is way way better. Um, so anyway, so I'm going to take you in the shop real quick. We had to disconnect everything when we were doing the wiring and putting the new breakers in and everything like that. But I wanted to come in here and show you this. Okay, and actually I'm very surprised that actually we still, we by the time we got everything up, everything was shaded. Uh, we were actually only pulling like 60 watts on this one when we got to that point. And we were pulling like 140 watts on that one. So earlier through, throughout the earlier part of the day, we had ended up pulling in 3.5 kilowatt hours on this side um, today. And now we picked up another one. So total of 3.6 with that one. This one obviously was just a 0.1, but it didn't go up. Uh, that's why I'm making my video so late. We just finished a little while ago. But that's why, um, you know, that is what it is. But... Uh, yeah, so everything is up now, everything is rewired, everything is good to go. And uh, so the system is all set for right now. And now I am very curious to see what uh, we are going to pull in on a decent day with everything up now. Uh, I think it looks beautiful, guys. I'm like really, really excited. Uh, this has not been a cheap project, I will tell you that. Um, you put so much into something and then you know oh now we need this now we need that now we need the other thing so uh that part of it is uh you know it's part of what happens but eventually what we're probably going to do i want to see how this holds up so what we have up here all together now we have four thousand and twenty watts that's what my solar system is right now okay um, down the road, we got these, you know, these other pieces here. We could actually add on three more panels, okay? I would probably put another pole in first before we did that, just to make it super safe. But if I added three more panels, uh, say three 300-watt panels, that would put us right, you know, at 4,920 watts. So I want to see how this works out with the 4,000 watts all up now, 4,020 watts all up now. But it's pretty exciting. Uh, it's a nice step in the right direction. Uh, this has been a project that we, you know, I've talked about, you know, for a long time. And now to have it done and have it up, um, super, super exciting. The next project that I am jumping into, honestly, is right there. I'm going to finish up the chicken coop. I will be working on that tomorrow. So chickens are coming soon. And uh, so I just, you know, I want to get that squared away. So uh, we're calling for rain tomorrow. So it's a great day to get inside and get going on what I need to do in there. So that's what I'm going to be working on tomorrow. Uh, what else did I wanted to tell you? Um, but yeah, so once this is done and then the chicken coop is done, then I think the next focus is maybe working on building some kind of a building here. Or even buying a small building, uh, I might do. I might go that route. I'm not sure yet. I will have to see. We'll have to see how that all goes. I don't know yet, but uh, maybe building something might be better because then we can just, you know, build it right to size the way that we want it. But uh, so that's what's happening here today at the homestead. We have been busy, 
and I'm tired and I'm dirty and I want to take a shower and uh, Heather's had a long day she's been gone I had to take her down to the school uh, this morning at like 7 this morning because they had an all day thing and they literally I just picked her up it was at 7 o'clock wasn't it yeah, it was right around 7 o'clock that I picked her up, so she was like at a 12-hour day. But that's okay. It's good for her. builds character. And it was like manual labor. They're over there, baby girl. They're over there. Okay. But uh, anyway, so um, I did want to mention, too, again, the legacy sale on my website is still going on. Uh, it's the 120 breakfast, lunch, and dinner bucket. It is available. You buy one, you get the second one at half off, so you have to buy two. Uh, it's a good way to start your food storage for your long-term food storage with the freeze-dried food. So if you are looking to do that, that would be the way to go. Uh, also, guys, I just wanted to mention real quick, remember, we are all in this together. That's important to remember. You know, a lot of people don't realize that, but we really, truly are. Um, also, remember, guys, hug and kiss the ones you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life. And uh, remember, guys, STD, it's one step at a time, one thing at a time, one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to accomplish, whatever you're trying to do, you can do it. The only one that's going to stop you from getting there is yourself. Nobody else can stop you. So if you work at things methodically, they will get done. Uh, it, it's, it's, just, it's a great feeling making progress. And as long as you just work at things, it's going to happen. Stay away from negative people. Stay away from that negativity. All they want to do is bring you down to their level because they're miserable and unhappy. Choose to be happy. It is absolutely a choice. All right, I will talk to you guys all tomorrow. I hope everybody's having a great day. Prepper Nurse One, out for now.